Hey, are you searching for Garmin watches? But it is very difficult for you which one is best among these Garmin watches. Don't worry I help you make a decision. I have done a lot of research, read a lot of reviews, and then concluded that Garmin watches are the best for people like you. If you want to know the price and other information, be sure to check my description. Number 1. Garmin Fenix 7 The Fenix 7 is Garmin's popular flagship watch. Garmin Fenix 7 encapsulates a Garmin watch. What's better than cheaper Garmin fitness watches? It offers great on-watch maps and big internal storage. Mobile internet isn't needed. The Fenix 7 has Venue 2's Elevate Heart Rate Tech. We were impressed by how well it tracks with our benchmark chest strap band. Fenix 7 has deeper outboard kit connections than Instinct 2. It controls a clever turbo trainer. It's too bulky for comfortable sleep tracking, but there are alternatives. You can upgrade to the standard size Garmin Fenix 7 with titanium housing and sapphire glass. Lighter is a Fenix 7 overkill. Unless you're a fitness fanatic, a Venue 2 Plus may suffice. Besides maps and a few connection enhancements, Instinct the 2nd of May do. Number 2. Garmin Forerunner 255. Garmin watches are costly. The Forerunner 255 is for consumers who want a costly watch's main experience for less. These basic parts include a memory and pixel display that's always on by design. Forerunner 255 contains the same GPS and heart rate technology as other Garmin watches. It has a two-week battery life and displays VO2 max and training status. This is an affordable training watch. Some features are missing. This polymer watch lacks the metal accents of the Venue 2. It lacks Garmin's Golf Mode, which gives course layouts worldwide. Only the more costly Forerunner 255 music models offer on watch music, and storage is restricted to 4 gigabytes. No member of this family supports downloading maps, but you can see a breadcrumb trail. Some will miss these extras, but the Garmin Forerunner 255 will be as effective as the company's more expensive watches for many. Number 3. Garmin Epix 2 For 5 years, hikers who needed on watch maps bought the original Garmin Epix. The Epix 2 is a Fenix 7 with an OLED screen and great maps. It's clearer, bolder, and more colorful, which helps screen maps. We appreciated the Epix 2's OLED screen at home after a few weeks of use. Garmin Epix 2 is flashier and more smartwatch like than Fenix 7. The essential features are identical. Great depth and heart rate accuracy, with fast GPS. Why? Garmin Epix 2 is more expensive than Fenix 7. If priced similarly, the Epix would be first. In always-on mode, the Epix 2's OLED screen doesn't last as long as the Fenix 7's. It lasts 6 days, not 2 weeks like the Fenix. We regularly review full smartwatches with day-long battery life. In that context, a week's use isn't surprising. Number 4. Garmin Venue 2 Plus Garmin's Venue range includes smartwatches. Thinner and lighter than flagship models, this watch is more comfortable. It's more refined than Garmin. This watch's OLED screen is much brighter than the Forerunner, Fenix, and Instinct screens. Smartwatches as locks. No, screen on all day reduces battery life from 7 minutes 9 days to 4 days. Garmin watches last longer than smartwatches. The cheaper Forerunner 955 has more on watch maps than the Venue 2 Plus. You can navigate on your phone using the Garmin Connect app, but not on the watch. It's less of an adventure watch but perfect for regular wear and fitness. Heart rate hardware resembles costly Garmin watches. Garmin Venue 2 Plus has Google Assistant, Apple Siri, and Samsung Bixby voice capabilities. It's clunkier than Apple Watch Siri, but Garmin's first. Venue 2 Non Plus has no digital assistant. It's cheaper and less elegant but performs similarly. Number 5. Garmin Instinct 2 Garmin Instinct 2 is easy to spot. This super rugged outdoor watch is chunky for people who don't mind. The Instinct 2 offers 10 ATM water resistance, double that of other decent wearables at the price. Long trekking weekends without a charging point or a breeze. Instinct 2 costs half as much as certain Garmin flagships. The screen is modest and monochromatic, but the inverted porthole highlights your heart rate. This circle became our favorite. Garmin Instinct 2 lacks comprehensive map capability, a big plus in an adventure watch. The watch doesn't keep mapping data, so you can only see a breadcrumb trail of where you've been. It helps you avoid getting lost but doesn't plan routes on the fly. Instinct 2 doesn't play local music, it simply controls phone music. We chose another model for several reasons. The Instinct 2's tracking accuracy is great, and its low maintenance, go anywhere ease should not be underestimated. This video is helpful for you. Please like and subscribe to my channel and press the bell button for more videos. And also check the description box for mentioned each product link. Thanks for watching this video.